Welcome back CQR fans. Once again we're at Banner Recreation and Marine in Vernon, BC, Canada and checking out a 2022 Can-Am Outlander 650 Camo. Another great looking ride. Stick around. Alrighty, so this guy is a 62 horsepower Rotax 650cc engine. It's a V-twin, liquid cooled, electronic fuel injection, of course. You got your typical CVD, CVT transmission, P, uh, your park, your reverse neutral high and low, and your standard engine braking. The drivetrain is a selectable two and four wheel drive with your Visco Lock QE auto locking front differential. And you have a tri-mode dynamic power steering. So your front suspension, let me adjust this a little. Your front suspension on this guy is an arched dual A-arm with front sway bar. 23 centimeters or 9.2 inches of wheel travel. Oil dampened shocks. You've got a torsional trailing arm independent TTI in the rear with 25 centimeters or 9 inches of wheel travel and oil shocks there as well. And as far as tires are concerned, you're going to have some Carlisle ACT HD tires. They're 26 by 8 by 12 in the front and 26 by 10 by 12s in the rear and your 12 inch cast aluminum rims as you see here. So your front brakes are going to be dual 214 millimeter discs with hydraulic twin piston calipers and your rear is a single 214 millimeter brake with a hydraulic twin piston caliper as well. So please excuse the noise in the background, they have a gymnastics class happening upstairs. Uh, so your dimensions, your length, your width, your height, it's going to be 218 by 121 by 126 centimeters or 86 by 48 by 49 inches. Your wheelbase is 129 centimeters or 51 inches. Your ground clearance is 30 and a half centimeters or 50, oops, sorry. The ground clearance is 30 and a half centimeters or 12 inches. Your estimated dry weight is 341 kilograms or 749 pounds. Your rack capacity is 45 kilograms or 100 pounds. Your rear rack is 90 kilograms or 200 pounds. Your storage capacity is 121 liter or 5 gallon storage capacity in the rear. Your towing capacity is 750 kilograms or 1650 pounds. Your fuel capacity is 20 and a half liters or 5.4 gallons. Your seat height is 87 centimeters or 34 and a half inches. So this, this would be a, a machine I would definitely recommend. It's definitely big enough in size. Comes with some decent options. It's gonna, the XT version, which is this, you're gonna have a winch. You're gonna have a front bumper. Going to have aluminum rims and bigger tires. It's got the mossy oak camo, which looks really sweet. And this is just going to be like an all time or all around good machine. This will do just about anything you'd want it to do. You can do a bit of, a bit of mudding, you can obviously do trail riding and stuff. It's not specifically designed for just one thing, which is good. And uh, the 650 will be plenty of horsepower. You will definitely have a thrill factor with this machine, guaranteed. And it's a Can-Am product, so you know it's made well. Got decent tires to start. You wouldn't even have to get a winch for it, obviously. Still got your digital display like all the rest. There's your four-wheel drive switch and your throttle. Built-in hand guards. Right. Your headlights, your start switch, kill switch, your uh, override switch, and heated grips. Here's your key and your 12-volt power supply. 
got some decent racks in the front. I'm not really a fan of the plastic ones, but these do feel solid. And they do have some rubber type of top on it, like an anti-slip, which is nice. Got fender flares. So if you brush up against a tree or a fence or something, you take this out rather than your actual paint. It's a great idea. Finally, a two-inch receiver. Brilliant. And this will be your storage bin back here. That's fine. That's fine. That looks big enough. Right on. And it's underneath. It's not through the rack. So you could put a box on here and still use this storage uh, storage bin, which is good. All right. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. Appreciate you guys clicking on the channel. While you're here, please hit the subscribe button and the like. The more times those are hit, the better it is for the channel, and it just gives me more opportunity to give you guys the content that you like watching. So appreciate you guys being here. Come down to Banner Recreation and Marine and check them out. They have a great selection of vehicles and stuff right now. Now would be the great time to come here, um, just because of their stock. Lately, stock has been an issue for every name brand in town. And just let them know that Canadian Quarters Review sent you. We'll see you guys on the next one. And thanks again for watching.